हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टी के फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग फाइन फ्रेंड्स वेल फ्रेंड्स आई हैव अ पार्सल टुडे आई रिसीव अ पार्सल फ्रॉम दिस इज रिसीव फ्रॉम बेंगलुरु ओके दिस इज आल्सो अ साउंड एंड लाइट कंपनी सो ही सॉ माय वीडियो ऑन यूट्यूब एंड ही कॉल मी अप एंड आई टोल्ड हिम टू सेंड इट बाय पार्सल सो ही हैज लेट्स अनबॉक्स दिस वन एंड चेक व्हाट इज इनसाइड So guys, this is the module of our T8 DB technology and line array line array. So see, like this, there are total one, two, three, four, five are there. So let's. So guys, there are total five module are there. See, okay, T eight module. Let's check. So this is they have written noise when XLR inserted, and this is power problem. This is also power problem. Power problem. Power problem. So guys, just keep watching my video. We so will start preparing this one one by one. So I will upload all the fault, whatever the fault is there on this uh, my YouTube channel. So let's start one by one for repair this one, guys. Thank you very much. So friends, will they have written clearly over here this power problem? So let's check what's the issue inside. So we'll put it on. I'll put it on. So if I put it on, I should get light over here. So I put it on. So there is no light. Okay. So first we'll check the fuse. I put it off. Okay. So we'll check the fuse. The fuse is blown off. This is three point one five ampere. So we'll put the new fuse. This is okay fuse. So we got two fuses. This is the blown off fuse. This is the okay fuse. So we'll put it. the fuse but the remember do not put it on unless we check it out okay guys so first we will check uh, so i put the fuse but do not put it because the fuse blown off it means that there is a some serious shorting is there inside so what we will do we will remove all the screws so we will dismantle the power supply board okay guys just keep watching my video So this is the one. See you guys, we have remote. Can take this out. 
so we will we'll move it out keep this aside so now we will work here something burning is there you can see some burn over here you can see some burn over here this IC so this IC is very badly burned this is the amplifier IC uh, the number of this IC is TDA8954 TH so this is the so guys this is the main IC the, the number of this IC is TDA8994 so this is a stereo high efficiency class D power amplifier IC so I think we if this is blown off so naturally this both will uh, damage I think uh, otherwise what we will do we will replace this IC with the new one because it is see already the pins are very badly shorted see the pins and see the pins over here and over here so we need to replace this IC guys so we will replace this IC with the new one so we will start uh, removing this IC ok guys so we will replace this and this both we will remove it out and we will replace both the IC with the new one because it is shorted completely as so you can see it is very badly shorted ok so just keep watching my video guys till end So guys, we have removed the two IC. There are the so both IC we have removed it out. So both see the battery damage. Pins are broken. This set pins are okay, and this pins are broken. So this IC also get shorted. So remember, one uh, one IC is gone. So better to replace both IC. Okay. So now we will replace this two IC with new one so first we will clean this one clean like this need so that so now we'll fix this both IC with the new one so guys we'll replace this uh, two IC so both the same number IC ok guys so we'll replace this so I got the new IC with me this is the new IC same number this is the original IC TD8954 PX. We will replace this IC. Two IC is there. Yeah. We'll keep apply to the See. 
so perfect okay so like this we have to solder so we have replaced this to faulty ic with the new one so now we'll fix it back and we'll check the status just keep watching my video guys till end So guys, I have fixed back everything. So now it's time to check. So we'll uh, fix the power input. We will input. So we'll put it on. So I'll put it on. I'll put it on. See power comes. So it's on. So we'll do the input signal also. We'll check the signal is coming or not. Okay. So it's working. See signal also coming. So it is working fine. See guys. Even the input signal. Okay. So it's working fine. So what we have done, we had, what we have done is we have just replaced these two IC in this uh, amplifier IC. So with new one so guys it's working fine so guys thank you very much for watching my video take care see you very soon next video bye